multiple worlds of our universe swirl in an endless abyss. Many worlds ravaged by time or conflict are swallowed by the abyss, returned to the nothingness from which they were formed. But others linger for eternity on the brink of annihilation, that creation might be balanced with destruction. And in the final moment of battle, death was banished to one such world in the autumn of its life, yet not far from the edge of darkness. Had death been sent to his doom, that answer would be found in the horseman's future and in his past. Who the Be hell are you? horsemen who are wounded. Don't touch me. Your arrival here is a bad omen. Yes. It troubles me greatly. Old one, there's more trouble ahead if you don't start making sense. Where is the tree of life? Life? <laughs> this world is dying, lad. Choking on chaos and corruption. We can do little to stop it. Soon, the great tree too shall perish, and with it, the last of my people. Is that not what brought you here, Pale Rider? I seek the tree, though chaos and corruption don't concern me. It's clobbering time. It seems they do concern me. So death is considerably quicker than war was in, in the previous game. He's, he's more agile. Um, at least that's what I think of it. A lot of hammer. The hell's not low. At least a quarter of the bar. I live on the edge. <laughs> you fight well, but this corruption can't be beaten with a blade. Seek out the Forge Sister. Ask her about the fire of the mountain. Help her, and she will help you reach the tree. As for me, I must return to my work. And who are you to command a rider? I am a maker. Older than even the Charred Council, these hands have laid the foundations for many worlds. But that was long ago, and now they but hardly know the touch of stone. Are you not curious as to why I seek the tree? I would not presume to question one of the four, but yes, tell me. I must restore humanity to redeem war. Heaven and hell battle upon the shattered earth. All creation trembles, and at the center of it all stands your brother. He is innocent. I never said he wasn't. The tree holds power over life and death. If you would resurrect humanity, then you are headed in the right direction. Be warned. A dark presence dwells now within the tree. And the path is barred by corruption. Right, so I need to find Alia. Whoever that is. Ooh! Level up. Well, time to spend some skill points. What to get? Emulation. Oh, I can have an army? I might go with that.
Oh, okay, so now you can assign it to. That looks cool. Ah, chest. Gold. Glorious gold. Ooh. Claws. I'm going to test those out. <clears throat> Replace the hammer. Yeah. Now that looks like you're just gonna fuck someone's day up, doesn't it? Guess we go this way. So, okay, so that's where I need to go. Okay. Straightforward enough. Rolling, rolling, rolling. No, okay. I'm gonna stop singing, sorry. <laughs> Ooh. Has got a monobrow. I guess that's the chick I need to speak to. Who's this guy? I just remembered. So these giant people remind me of Ulthane in the first game. If you ever played the first game, you'll know Ulthane. Scottish geezer. Scottish sounding geezer. <laughs> Reaper. It's about time you came. The makers are dying, and our realm. We few are all that remain. A warrior's life is never easy, old one. Aye, not easy, but simple. I always saw my end with blade in hand, a field of enemy dead before me. And what glorious end awaits you hiding behind these gates? <sighs> you cannot fight corruption, nor can you harm it. You can only kill those it has claimed. Every blow I strike against corruption is a blow against my own people. Muse on that, Ryder, before you mark me as a coward. Can't afford anything right now. Don't have enough gold. <laughs> RB and X. Ah, it's got some distance to it. I can 
can end your troubles, Maker. Well, you're welcome to try. This blade is more ancient than you, Ryder. And taller to boot. I will break it, and you, down to size. Come at me, bro. <laughs> Holy. Okay, he deals a lot of damage. And I don't deal very much. Ow. like the RPG element that they've added so you can see the hit points um, it just seems a bit silly because if you focus on an enemy you can see their health bar as well uh, so I'm not particularly sure why there's the need for health points but whatever it looks good I guess it's like a minor thing though I think What's this? Your inbox is empty. I didn't know how death had email. Crucible pass. Oh, this is that thing for sending stuff. Um, yeah, THQ mentioned it a while back. Uh, you can send stuff to friends and send items and things like that. Right, let's talk to this chick. Maker's beard. The rumors are true. A horseman in the Forge Lands. The name's Alia, and that's my brother Valis. We are the keepers of this forge. Though I reckon that means less now than once it did. This is a Maker's Forge? Nay, the Maker's Forge is lost to us. Silenced by the hands of corruption. But in its depths, we once crafted the dark towers of hell and the cities of heaven. Now you make trinkets. And you, one of the four, now seek the aid of the makers? I guess we've all fallen from high places. Ouch. Can you see in the tree and your elder speaks of fire. What is it? Aye, the fire of the mountain, the stone father's blood. It once flowed into our four, jazzed at the tears. Both imbued our craft with incredible power. The heart and the soul of stone. But corruption has taken them and now our forge is silent. Why does this concern me? The way to the tree is lost, barred by corruption. You can no more leave this place than we. Restore our forge, and the tree can be reached. I don't follow your reasoning. We are makers, not warriors. But we are not without our weapons. Before the forge was lost, we crafted a mighty creature of soul and stone. A colossus to fight this corruption. But to awaken him requires a maker's key. And we need our forge to craft one. Will you help us? Slow your roll. I may have need of a blade. Is your need greater than ours, horseman? I think not. We fight for the survival of our realm and our kin. Prove worthy. And perhaps we can do business. Man of no words, your brother. <laughs> but hardly silent. His voice is the ring of the hammer and the roar of the white flame. Yes, he works while you talk. What is this cauldron? A temple built in the shadow of Stonefather's Peak. There the fire of the mountain was harnessed and passed into our forge. Ride east of town, ride through the charred pass and towards the cindery peak of the Stonefather. There you will find the cauldron. Alright, guess we'll go find this cauldron.